So finally, Mike screamed, let's go. And King just wakes up out of this shock because he just confused that where the fuck are these people with. So King pulls off. They're in the car talking about what all they seen, where the people went, where the people came from. So they decided they was all going to stay at Keisha house. Like, you know, double date. We're going we gonna to end at Keisha house. So everybody went back to Keisha house. And in the middle of the night, Myra gets up and she comes in the room with Keisha. And she like, Keisha, Keisha, bitch, I need you to get up. So Keisha like, what the fuck? What, bitch? What do you want? Go to bed. She like, I need you to come look at this. Keisha like, look, it's late. I'm tired. Can you please just go lay down and we can talk about this shit in the morning? She like, no, bitch. I'm not going back in there. You need to come look at this shit. So at this point, Keisha like, whoa, look at what? What the fuck? So fucking Myra dives on the bed and wake up King ass. So she like, look, y'all need to get the fuck up and come look at this shit. So they're like, what? She's like, just Mike, come look at Mike. So they all get up and they go in now. And Mike is asleep. His eyes is closed. But Mike is walking towards the front door. He's at the front door like he's trying to go out of it. But his head keeps hitting the door. He'll walk and then he'll back up. And then he'll walk into the door stopping. He'll back up. But Mike's eyes was closed the whole fucking time. Now, how did Mike, being at this house, not knowing this fucking house, first time ever being there, knew how to maneuver around this house in his sleep. He was able to get up out the fucking bed, walk to the left, three steps to the right, around the corner, down the hallway. He did all this in his fucking sleep. And he is trying to get out this fucking room, this, this house. Sleep. He is walking into the fucking door. Boom. Boom. So she like... Go over there and say something to your homeboy. Do your homeboy know him to sleep while he like, I don't know, I don't sleep with that man. I don't know if he fucking sleep I don't know. She like, go over there and say something to him. So he like, hey Mike, bro, you good? Mike still asleep, but walking into the fucking door. And he called Mike like three, four times. And Mike still kept doing the same old shit. He just got irritated. He like, you know what? Fuck it, I'm finna shake his ass. I'm finna wake him up. I'm finna shake his ass. And Mike was like, no, no, no. Don't do that because you ain't supposed to wake people up that sleepwalking. He like, fuck this. We ain't supposed to let him keep walking into the door. He gonna fuck around and bust his head in with. So she like, I guess. Go ahead. Wake him up. So he go over there and he shake Mike ass hard as shit. He like, Mike. Mike. And Mike. And he get to screaming just like he was at Layla Neal. Uh, he get to screaming loud and shit again. They're like, what the fuck is going on? So King tackled Mike. Boom. Knock his ass to the couch. Mike like, what the fuck is going on? What's going on? What's going on? Mike didn't know where the fuck he was. Mike like, what's going on? What's going on? They're like, you good? He like, how the fuck? Where am I? Where am I? They're like, you at the house. How do we get to the house? How do we get here? What's going on? They're like, what the fuck you mean? How do we get here? He like, how do we get here? How do we get to the house? They're like, we rolled to the fucking house. Mike like, no, I didn't ride to no house. I was at the beach. And they're like, you was at the beach? And Mike was like, the last thing I remember was walking backwards on the beach and I had my arms out. He was like, I don't remember coming here. I don't even remember how we got here. So now the question lies. Who the fuck did Mike bring with him? Because Mike don't remember running to the car. Mike don't remember getting in the car. Mike don't remember riding to the damn house in the car. Mike don't remember getting in the bed. Mike don't remember none of that shit. Mike don't remember nothing but the water, him backing up, playing in the water, and then waking up right there in that apartment on that couch being tackled by King. So at this point, everybody creeped the fuck out. Like, what the fuck... Now Keisha and Myra are like, bitch. Um, yeah. So I had some things that I have to do tomorrow that I forgot about, but Keisha just reminded me. And um, y'all can't stay. Cause at this point, this motherfucker can get up in the middle of the night and kill all of us in this goddamn house. Plus, we don't even know what kind of spirit he done brought back in this bitch with him. We not staying tonight. He not staying, they're not staying tonight. Cause I ain't trying to wake up dead. I ain't trying to wake up. A, a, a fucking resident of Oscarville cause he done drug my ass or drove my ass back to the fucking lake while I was asleep no so she instantly came up with a lie yeah I got something to do tomorrow it's very early in the morning I forgot all about it but Keisha reminded me and you guys can't stay while Keisha's saying it while, while Keisha um, while Myra saying it King is standing over the door like behind Mike Mike got the puppy dog eye Oh man, are you are you serious? Man, and I had such a good time with you today. You sure? You know, we can't, you know, finish the night off good. And she like, no. 
you know, because I got some things to do and, um, you know, I'm going to be real busy tomorrow, maybe some other time. And he just kept trying to come up with shit and come up with shit. And she was just like, mm, no, I'm sorry. I'm just not feeling it. Um, I got too much to do. And King instead of giving her a look. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. And if you want to know the end of the story, it's already on my YouTube. I hope you enjoyed the story. I love you guys. Please watch my videos. Please subscribe. And I love you. A H for life.